hey guys and welcome back to another video so today I am going to be getting some pumpkin pancakes prepped and ready to go one of my favorite things to do especially with having two young kids and being pregnant and just everything that comes with parenthood it's way easier for me to prep things in advance, have it in the fridge or have it in the freezer, heat it up, toast it, whatever the case may be. So today I'm going to be prepping some pumpkin pancakes. I'm going to keep some of them in the fridge and maybe some in the freezer just depending on how much I can get out of this recipe. I found the recipe on Pinterest. I can go ahead and link it down below so if you... So like I said, I'll go ahead and link the recipe down below. It, it looks fairly simple. Um, and then I'll also tell you how much of each ingredient is in this recipe. Um, I have everything that I could possibly need at this point. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and start pulling things out. And then, yeah, I feel like I just, I always talk way too much in these intros. So go ahead and get started. Um, like I said, I'm going to get everything pulled out, get mixing, get the griddle going, and get some pancakes started. All right, so I have all of my ingredients. Um, I had to melt some butter, pull out an egg, and yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get started. And like I said, I will have the recipe that I'm following down below, or linked, I should say. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. So I will say, I think it'd be good with pumpkin pie spice, just saying. So 
I think it's safe to say that this recipe is definitely a hit because my picky eater is eating eating it without complaint but I will say it smells like pumpkin pie it tastes like pumpkin pie and it actually has a really good texture so I highly highly recommend making those pancakes for your kids for the fall season and, I, and you know I would even go as far as to add chocolate chips to it which I might do it was seriously so good <laughs> is your pancake yummy mm -hmm. yeah is it good is it good mm -hmm. you being shy So I'm gonna go ahead and end the video here. I hope you guys try this recipe out. Like I said, it'll be linked down below. It is so stinking good. So highly, highly, highly recommend. And I would even, like I said, add that pumpkin pie spice seasoning as well um, instead of the cinnamon. Probably be a game changer. So we'll see you in tomorrow's video. You guys have a great day. Bye.